Stand by for action. All right, boys and girls, how's it fucking going there? I tell you what, I was going on, it's bloody freezing out here, Andy boy. In the fort of Dean, my little pinkies are bloody freezing, Andy boy, I tell you that much. So, Borodash, and my house it going? It's high day. <laughs> Morning, everybody. It's Saturday, the 13th of January already, can you believe that? Um, I'm here in the fort of Dean. It's not icy, but it's fecking cold. My fingertips are chuffing freezing. Anyway, yeah, just a nice little casual sesh at the FOD. It's more gonna do a few of the Verdi stuff and some of the twisty down early stuff, but more of the, the Verdi cross country just to get myself back into pedaling the bike, even though I'm on a scooter, so. I'm here on the rise. Uh, put the new cassette on, and when I put the new cassette on, after the uh, Kumkan adventure, I noticed the hub, the cassette was wobbling on the hub, so I took the bike into Coombe Cycle in Hereford, and they had looked at it, and the, uh, the free hub bearings were just collapsed, so they put new bearings in, and that's all good now, so that's a nice new trendy, trendy thingy cassette cog thing, from, I'm not sure where I got that, Air Bikes, I think, it was cheap and it's really good, so I've had a few things from Air Bike. Uh, going back to Coombe Cycles, Hereford, Wide Marsh Street. I've used them a few times actually recently and they're really good. So I'm going to continue to use Coombs. Um, yeah, they're really nice. Nothing against Climb On, but they are a bit pricey. But Coombs, just nice, friendly personal service. And I'm going to drop the uh, the Wild in on Monday to get a full gear service because derailleur gears are a black art to me. <laughs> anyway, without further ado, Andy boy, let's rise to the occasion and rise up there. Like Owen Glendour, he will rise again in Wales's hour of need. He will rise like the rise electrically, Andy boy. <laughs> right in a bit. All right then, let's see the car park. I hope I've got the uh, the GoPro settings right. Let's see how it goes. Let's see how it goes. It's cold, but it's not bitterly cold. All right then, let's go and get warmed up. Right, just used a bit of the, uh, the hover cam in landscape mode. Thank you very much, Lee T, for giving me the prod to say, switch it over from portrait. I thought portrait was standard. <laughs> anyway, it took me a bit of a while to figure out how to do it, but it was staring at me all the same in the face. So I done it. So thank you, Lee T, mate. Boston R, off to get together sometime, 24. Bloody hell, my fingertips are free. <laughs> Absolutely killing. Come on, blood, get pumping round. And my little pinkies warmed up. Becking, freezing. I don't want to speak too soon, but I think, I think my fingers are starting to warm up a little bit now. <laughs> Jesus crikey Charlie, bloody cold. Especially this one and that thumb. Oh dear me. Right, we're going to drop into the bottom sections of the verders now. Morning. Hey, what's up Doug?
fingers are starting to warm up a little bit more now, which is grand. Just got a cold head with the wind now. <laughs> There's no pleasing old man, is there? Right, this is the final descent of the verge now. Going a bit fast, very cold. Give up morning, old man. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, that's a bit steep, they've done something to that. Pirate coming out there. Oh. Looks like we've done a bit of work over winter to the uh, to this trail, which is really nice. So let's slip in the wheel. That's the bottom section of the birds. I think this is called Nun's Chuff. Where do we go? Is it this way? So many different lines popping off everywhere.
Right, let's do whatever this one is. Nice and steady. Handlebars on the old tree. Not sure if I've actually done this one. Have I done this one? I don't know. I think I do some, need to do some readjusting on my new shoes and the mag pen, magnet and the air plate on the shoe. Oh. Right, let's go look at this one. I think this might be the bomb hole one. I don't know. We've got some piggies. First time I've seen some little piggies in the forest. Yeah, this is the bomb hole one. Excellent. Breaks. No, no. No speed. Right. Right, we're just doing countdown and get into launch pad and then go and have a cup of coffee.
Right then, let's go and have a cup of coffee and a sausage sarnie. Right, there we go, peeps. Nice little sesh at the FOD of Dean. Yeah, it's good fun. It's nice to have the bike back 100% again. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's about it, really. Bloody cold. I think I need to uh, review my early morning cold riding gear because my fingers were chuffing, freezing, really cold. So, other than that, it was all good. Um, not quite sure what's happening next week. Try and get a bit of biking. Fingers crossed the uh, the plucky bomber's going to be on the road. So, <clears throat> see what's happening and try and meet up with Mark's brother Justin and go for some a burnout on the on the mopeds well not a burnout because I've got to run the motor in anyway that's it you know the drill like subscribe drop a comment and uh, yeah until the next random content in a bit peeps <laughs>